Hey there, Central Texas. I'm Sydney Eisenberg, and here's what made headlines this week. Over the weekend, we learned more about the shooter in Odessa that left eight people dead and 19 injured. Online records indicate that the shooter, Seth Ader, was from Lorena. He also had an arrest record in McLennan County. Lorena ISD later confirmed that he attended the school between 1995 and 2000. However, he did not graduate from the school. Now on Tuesday, Walmart announced it will discontinue the sale of handgun ammunition. The store is also requesting customers to refrain from openly carrying firearms in the stores. Now law enforcement officers will still be able to openly carry indoors. Wednesday, we brought you the story of one Limpasas man who's trying to make Limpasas County a Second Amendment sanctuary city. Daniel Gron says he created the petition to protect the right to bear arms. The Limpasas County Commissioner's Court said that they cannot comment on the petition, but they plan to do more research before making any decision. Thursday, Governor Greg Abbott issued eight executive orders in response to the mass shootings in El Paso and Odessa. The orders enhance reporting requirements and ensure training for law enforcement agencies and the public. And Friday, Baylor University released an active shooter training video that caused quite a stir on social media because of its intensity. The video depicts a real-life shooting situation on campus in order to illustrate proper safety procedures for students, faculty, and staff. Now for more details on all of these stories, visit our website at kxxv.com.